All right, folks, the deck is Even Armor Warrior. The goal of the deck is to draw Odin Prime Designate as early as possible so that we can make use of the low-cost hero powers to start bursting our opponent down with both Bring It On, and Frozen Buckler, and Even Dr. Boom Scheme. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash raffle or here on YouTube. All right, now's a good time to remind you that if you haven't yet, please like the stream. I'm still gigantic. Um, takes just a moment. Helps me out immensely, so. Denathrius versus Jaina. You asked for it. Let your penance begin. Oh, yeah. We're just always going to keep the Dr. Boom scheme, right? Oh, it's a silly goose thing to do, but we're going to do it anyway. Hey, welcome, Nick. Hope you're feeling better soon. Finally, scheme is useful? I mean, we'll see. <laughs> There's no promises. No guarantees that that'll be the case. But we can hope. We're living in an era where Boom Scheme is a win condition. Let that sink in. I mean, I'm pretty sure we're not. It's still a meme. But at least it's a moderately uh, viable meme, maybe. We have turned our curse into our strength. You know if Scheme works with that end of turn doubler? Um, I actually don't. Unfortunately, it's an odd cost card anyway, so we wouldn't be able to run it, but... I think that there are some similar interactions that do work with it. I just don't know if they're, like, uh, these types of cards specifically. But, like, sticking that card is uh, often pretty ambitious. Probably no reason to expend this yet. I might use it next turn. Would Dr. Sco Boom Scheme be playable if it upgraded everywhere, regardless of where it is? Um, it could certainly be more playable, I don't know. I don't know if that would like change or dramatically ch like change the uh, the effect of the card enough to make it see play. Rhythm Paladin is fun, but probably not S tier. I don't think anyone ever expected it to be anywhere near S tier, though. So it's probably fine. I'm late. I'm late. Why didn't you play coin? The goal is to coin the Odin, and uh, the card that I gave away into the coin was not terribly valuable. Power is what you seek. Knowledge is what I provide. Welcome, Sandor. Wow, 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 oh, wow, watch this Ruffalo, oh, oh. Welcome, Benno. Glad you made it. Thank you for the, uh, thank you for the super chat. 
Okay, we might actually have to use uh, the boom scheme next turn. We go here, hero power, and then we still have to give up the coin. That'll feel bad. The sound is off, Raffle. Yeah. I'm sure you're the first person to notice out of the hundreds of people that I've been uh, chatting with already. What's the win lose for now? I have finished zero games of Hearthstone. Six, eight, coin the, uh, yeah. So I have to coin first here. Fortunately, that looks like it could be like an objection, which would be bad for my next turn, which involves the Minotauran. Or maybe it doesn't. Where you followed. That was really unfortunate, but we should have a clear next turn with the uh, title Revenant. Or maybe not. I was kind of expecting that to be... Um, I guess we can just Warpath either way. I was expecting that to be Objection, not to uh, Rig Fair Game... Uh, explosive. Twist dead, haven't seen anything about it. They are taking the planned break that was planned. <laughs> Misplay? Yeah, you're right, I should concede. Someone in chat didn't like my decision making. Like YouTubers then playing breaks means they are dead, yeah. Cool. Thanks for the BM. The scheme Odin worked out. It is. The stream has been live for eight minutes. I've played one game of Hearthstone. Oh, welcome, Asimo. Welcome, uh, Cringe Thulu. Denathrias versus Valera. Shall we dance? Let your penance begin. Oh, I've got Odin again. Fortunately, it does not seem like the bot's situation has improved. It's just a card for a specific hero power switch or just a general situational card? Well, it can only switch to one hero power, so it's just there because I wanted to play the card. I think the sh early shield block was the misplay of that game. Okay. We have turned our curse into our that strength. Jesus. 
That uh, demonstrates a lack of understanding of the game. But sure. Never bring a sword to a fish fight. Yaha. Rothwell, would you still like my deck suggestions if I were a worm, crying face? I mean, as long as the deck suggestions don't change, then sure. I don't see why not. Wow, this is a Rothwell registered moment. Robot, skull, woman face palming, chat stop. <laughs> Thank you, Constance. I don't think that's going to get them to stop. I've been trying for years. But, but not sure what it right. Brian has against clowns, but he completely skipped over the clown emoji there. Oh, hey, my shield block didn't get counterspelled. Surely I cannot lose now. Trust the pirate's Is clownophobia? There's actually a name for that. I don't think it's clownophobia, though. Uh, do I take it for another turn? Maybe I just, uh... Let's take a coward's line. Do we? It's not that much damage, right? I can get better value off of the shield cheddar. It's only eight. Kind of hoping they would develop here. It's not much Rotten, development. You are very inspiring. You seem reborn, infused, and ready to charge into the weekend. There are a colossal number of chatters today. You have recruited so many. Wow. Is there an echo? Oh, man. I wish I could forge a good response to that, but thank you, Kaya. Do you think your chat has especially low social literacy, or is it all chatters? I feel like people are really rude to you. Um, no, I think most people with anonymity on the internet eventually, or like most spaces that allow for anonymity on the internet kind of converge into the same type of behavior is just what it comes down to. I don't think that my chat is, uh... necessarily unique in that regard or uniquely rude it's just how people on the internet tend to operate uh, but thank you the what Hopefully we can just slam an Odin next turn. This chat is not uniquely rude, but definitely unique. Yeah, I'll give you that. I'll give you that. Okay, probably can't to get away with playing the Odin here. Yeah, 
You're welcome, Shane. Oh yeah, we hit the nuts. It's Minotaur and just lifesteal, but with armor. Uh, essentially, yeah. Why don't you play Odin? Uh, so that I can win the game. And not lose the game. Because I have an understanding of the game state, mostly. Feed the fish, Don't know if it's been tested yet, but what's the interaction with Warden Attack in the game 5 Amour on Attack Minion? Um, anytime you gain armor, uh, you get an attack from Odin, so, um, you just, you gain 5 attack. Oh, we got both of them now. Scream for me! What about Armorsmith over th in this over Schemer Axe? How do you activate Armorsmith in any way in this deck? Um, that would not be a good inclusion, but you're welcome to add whatever cards you'd like. Now I have the space to play the Odin. Random, we probably just get there next turn. Seven, 17. Yeah, it's just lethal next turn. Fantastic. Do you have a one mana hero power? I am cheating. Uh, don't tell Blizzard. No, I didn't even have to hover. Scream for me! Bam! I didn't even realize I had an even cost card. <laughs> the Justice Card plus Gen is cool. Yeah, it's I really like overriding the benefit of uh, Gen. What in stacks if you bounce it could that be fun? Uh, yeah, it, I think the easier route. Uh, Denathrius versus Lunara would be. Like, just branding the Odin, right? With a little bit of cost reduction. But, I'm sure it could be, uh...
could be something worth doing. I mean, at a certain point, I'm not sure, like, how much stack it, like, it's very easy to do, like, 30 damage as it is, isn't it? Dr. Boost game is chat service, isn't it? Yeah, mostly. But it's also funny. Okay. Not gonna be able to get a whole lot of use out of the- oh god, did they have spread the- did they hit the absolute nuts? Maybe not absolute nuts, but it was a pretty nutty turn one. You're still going? Nature speaks through my tunes. At least this doesn't have too much downside because after the guff comes down they have like nothing but zero mana minions anyway. Why would you play that with no mana? Okay, now it makes sense. Just uh, take it for a turn. cards here because I don't have much of a hand. Nice. And I'm not going to get many opportunities to draw off of the uh, Outrider's Axe just because of the nature of the opponent's deck. Reflect in the moon. You cannot crack my cap. You cannot crack my cap. need to use my weapon charges, I guess. Chat, shuffle rogue feet algolan. Maybe funny. Most of the shuffle rug things shuffle into your own deck though, don't they? 
So I don't know that Algalon would uh, help with that necessarily. There are some new uh, shuffle synergies, I think, this set. Like there's a bird that could go in that deck. Nobody messes with my friends. No, I don't have to. Take eight here. When their hero power does so much. Scream for me. The wilds have granted you strength. Nobody messes with my friends. Oh, are we just dead here? Did you buy the premium Tyberon disc in yet? No, I most certainly did not. It, uh, it didn't even tempt me. New cards for Quest Road. Uh, probably not, but they didn't really need any. It was already the best deck going into the expansion. Nature speaks through my tunes. It's another owl, isn't it? But they also do have another Crypt Keeper, which would be a pretty big bummer. Especially off of the uh, Moonlight Guidance. That came off of the Piper. Just don't take 19 here. Well, it wasn't 19. Problem is, we're taking five every turn, and even with the Justicar hero power, we can't get too far ahead. Welcome to the Grand Tournament, Champion. Your power goes to two mana, yeah. Uh, that's the expected uh, outcome. Again, very specifically says you're starting hero power. It's a rake, okay. 
I had to swipe. A swipe. Alright. Amuse me with your tales of victory. Scream for me. Uh, I need to hit some armor gain that isn't boom scheme here pretty soon. I said that... It helps me survive against so little. What's the difference between one and two? Like Moonfire? Oh dear. What to do? What to do? Scream for me! Garoppolo isn't plagued DK, just Groat Rogue with diff extra steps. Uh, no. One shuffles into your deck, one shuffles into the opponent's deck. This curse has become our greatest strength. So the game plan for drawing the damage cards is very different between the two. I'm running out of cards. That was a good time to draw the Frozen Buckler. Uh, Kazgaroth or Tidal Revenant would be pretty good. I have no cards left. I think we've seen all of their minions, right? Maybe there's a Crypt Keeper. Jeez, I'm glad they didn't hit that sooner. You there's a Crypt Keeper. Oh my god. Another good draw. Prove your for me. Did we get there? It's 12, 16. I just need a little bit more damage and not to die. Oh, God. It's going to depend on if this is actually Moonfire or not. Or not. Our gift of the oh my god! <laughs> uh. Ruffle, how do you draw good? Did you... Did you see the Dr. Boom scheme draw? <laughs> Scheme draw one you to the game only in the instance where it was Moonfire in hand. Look, we'll keep the scheme this time. Clearly, that'll be good. Man, the cannons is really good in this matchup. Um, like, Shield Chatter is one of the reasons we kept uh, the boom scheme. I guess we don't know it's Pirate Rogue. We've just kind of come to expect it. Yeah. Man, the cannons is uh, technically a good answer to this early pirate board. The scheme have a cap. Uh, I mean, the game length or the turn t uh, timer. So, essentially, yes. Yeah, welcome, Rachel. Look, you shiny. All right, so we just. Uh, can the manans on this and uh, try to survive the weapon.
But look at that, an interesting interactive deck to play against. I, I just interacted with them. So. Right. Bonk. Look at that. I interacted with them again. Fire Rogue is annoying, but I mean, it's interactive, right? Yeah, and it's not even like a strong deck right now <laughs> either, so I don't know. Trust the pirate's code. <laughs> Every time I'm here, I, I hear the same conversation about interactive. Yeah, that's because people like repeating memes, even if they don't necessarily like understand the context of them. A good draw. That would have also worked, but very nice. Crazy that it's still a relevant aggro deck. I mean, it has fallen off abysmally of late, so I don't know that you necessarily could call it a relevant uh, aggro deck. Popular aggro deck because of low dust cost, yep. Give me that. And it has quick Come games, which some people are often looking for, so. Never Popularity is not necessarily directly correlated with strength. It just often is, because people like winning. Raffle, do you think that chat bipty topity boopity or lip flip dip tip? Personally, I think that wimmy wam woesly wahoo wow. I'll take your word for it because, uh, that all sounded like nonsense to me. But thank you, Benno. Scream for me! Alright, now's the time where we just, like, work hard to draw it towards, uh, the Odin. It is unfortunate that I haven't been able to interact with this opponent at all, and that's why we're losing. <laughs> that's not Odin. Scream for me. Wrong 8-drop deck. Opponent can't interact with you because of your media layer of armor. I mean, in a sense, like, my deck is less interactive than the opponent's, right? I'm just looking for to do some from-hand damage after surviving for several turns. So really, I'm part of the problem. I'd man, that dono made perfect sense to me. Well, you might want to go see a doctor, then. But thank you, uh, INXT. I found a small interactive metal pill on the road. Scream for me! Don't, don't eat it, please. Oh my god, we'd have so much damage if we could just draw the Odin. Our gift of frost us. We're gonna have to win the game with stupid sexy Astalor instead. Slammy whammy with the armor. That's, uh, yeah, that's what I'm going for. I don't know that I necessarily would phrase it like that, but you're welcome to. Uh, thank you, Sour Fluffy Nut. Oh, now you decide to show up when the game's already over.
Surprise no Geppetto to search for and discount. Well, to be fair, that's only because uh, Geppetto is an incredibly bad card. <laughs> like, it's already hard enough to set up a, a turn for Odin. We don't need to do that twice in a row. Yeah, thank you, Vincent. Oh, yeah. We got the Justicar. How could we lose? We have turned our curse into our strength. Skin means guaranteed pirate rogue. I mean, just rogue and wild fight. often means guaranteed pirate rogue. Geppetto to tutor Minotauran, instant rank one legend. Yeah, you can't beat that. Uh, no, after the Justicar, our hero power goes to two. Again, says specifically your starting hero power. Oh, yeah. Another good can the Manons. Get those manons out of here. Our gift of fire empowers us. Orden is fire. Orden empowers us. And he has gifts. Attack. Yay. Astala is referring to Orden. Astala predicted titans. True. True, very clearly, there's no other conclusion that we can come to. Uh, thank you, INXT. How does Gen and Benedictus interact? I'll let you think about that for a moment. Trust the pirate's code. <laughs> and maybe consider taking back your question. Games able playable aside from the rogue one. I don't even know if the rogue one was very good. Uh, generally, like Hearthstone is a very tempo based game. If you're having to hold cards, that does not bode well for the card's success. Blood and blunder. I get the scheme, yeah. I get the scheme was closest because it like waiting actually lines up with that what that card wants to do. So that's kind of a unique case in that regard. Scream for me. Listen here, pal. Play Sardia as all age consumes me. Well, I mean, historically the best way to or the. Thank you, INXT, said the streamer to Twitch chat. Oh, this is YouTube chat. Be careful, but thank you, INXT. Uh, historically, the the worst way to get me to do something is to demand that I do that. So uh, I don't know if that's necessarily going to have the results you're looking for. Start with portobello mushrooms. Wash, dry, and remove the stems. Broil till soft. Pack with tuna salad and cover with cheese. Melt under the broiler. What do we make? Sounds kind of tasty, to be honest. Thank you, Benno. Uh, do I feel safe at 11 here? Probably, because we're going to coin a title next turn. Mushroom tuna melt. Feed the fish, land lover. Doesn't sound bad. Please tell me that's not a secret passage. Thank you. 
Alright, uh, unfortunately this cannot be the Odin turn. Well, could it? I go to 11. The question is, should it? What to do? And the answer to that is probably no. No, it should not be. Next turn will be it, for sure. That just gives our uh, Dr. Boom scheme more time to ramp up. That's not good. I might have to take another turn off. It's like the worst possible card they could have uh, drawn for me. Trying to play the uh, the Odin here. Give me that. Love what I Blood and plunder. Look, you shiny. Yeah. I like. I have to play the Ranker here. Take your fried rice out, then get your fried rice in a bag and microwave it. Then take it out of the microwave, let it cool, then eat guess the recipe. Uh... Way to either ruin fresh fried rice or cook leftover fried rice. That would be my guess. Next turn we go in hard. Eat with the bag on? Well, yeah, you got to get your mic microplastics in. Oh, they missed. What a fool. You dastardly wizard. You've done it again. Correct. Uh, no, no. I'm no wizard. I am clearly a warrior. But uh, thank you again, INXT. Look at how good Dr. Boom's scheme was there. Plus two is fish. That is all. Yeah, that's uh, what I learned in my NA math education, so that checks out. Thank you, INXT. We have turned our curse into our strength. Uh, probably just go ahead and can that. I have the warpath if they uh, end up going wide. So it's just important not to uh, take a bunch of damage to that. Give me that. Not what I want. 
No, Ruffle, the can was from the tuna recipe. Okay, that makes sense. That's where we got the recipe, is from the Never can, right? The Thank you, I am team. Can you stop? Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, they can. You're eating fresh. Just pull into McDonald apostrophe STM. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No free advertising here. Or no reduced cost advertising, I guess is the case there. Uh, thank you, Constance. Oh, hey, Glenn. Resurrected the pigeons with technology. God. Not the scheme. Wait, why would you do that? That seems irresponsible. Our gift of frost shields us. I'd finally found peace from the pigeons, and now you're bringing them back? Can somebody tell this opponent to stop playing cards, please? Give me that. Not what I was. Oh, what a horrendously bad draw. Technically not dead. No fillet fighter, please. Okay. This is so stupid. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, absolutely gaming. Boom scheme, stay winning. Have you considered that the pigeons could have just been minor villains in your main story arc? Didn't think so, the real villain was me. <laughs> Do we need villains in, in any of this? Oh, thank you, INXT, I think. Alright. Probably just make the safe line, right? Just because we could die to stuff if we're... ...shoving the Odin. And we just set up lethal with the Astalor next turn anyway. There be no treasure six feet under. Rise me, hearty. Beautiful. What a great the time to top deck that. Gildeus.
Never a doubt. Like, scheme is just too strong. I'll be right back. Oh my god, we got a different, uh, class. I don't really know what I need against Priest. Odin? <laughs> Odin and Boom Scheme, that's all we need, right? We have turned our curse into our strength. Ah, ah, I see you brought guests. Uh-oh. Elune Adore. Moved into Warcraft 3 territory. Oh, thank you. Accept my gratitude. Run! Fast as you can. Just kill it, right? And then it's dead. Psychic detective coming through. Alright, have a couple of options for next turn, depending on what I want to do. At last, a worthy disciple. Okay. Makes me want to hold the coin here. Scream for me. Oh god, what if they get Odin? I don't think that would matter that much, but it'd be funny. Welcome, Bobo. Sure. So we know it's Reno, right? We want to do all of our damage at once. With me. Scream for me. I've already got 30. Uh, actually, I've got 35. Theoretically, it's GG on turn 8. It's fun when a new expansion comes out and everyone plays the same decks. They're playing Reno Questline? <laughs> Freeze? That's not... What? I'm seven That's unfortunate. Just need to dodge the uh, Mutanus. Meta Tyrant Reno Questline Priest, yeah. Uh, I'm sure there's some new new cards in their deck because it's just like a toolkit deck that. Oh no! Oh no! We got blocked for lethal here. Never mind. Oh, this is going to be outrageous. I've got 40 damage in hand. 
Welcome, Christina. Welcome, B. The time for mercy is over. This is a pretty awkward shape. Can't quite get through it, right? I can do 35. Play was kind of questionable. It kind of looked like a snipe, to be honest. It absolutely didn't. They complete. They played a five mana card to complete the quest. What? Seemed perfectly reasonable to me. Uh, I'm not crazy, right? There's no lethal here. I have little time. Is a little bit hesitant to give up the uh mm, skewer slice or slash uh the oh, shield cheddar last turn. the shield shattered draw at least. Odin is so busted and wild so much armor cards there. But there are far greater issues in Wild than, than Odin. Uh to do what to do disqualified that was lucky i did not think that through all the way i have little time I 
I needed to go one more time. I was impatient there. If power is what you seek, scream for me. Is what I, I have too many. Oh, that's a good burn. I just need to draw into the shield shatter. A brilliant sight. Sure. I'm undead, not dead, dead. Okay, this time it'll be GG finally. As good as I imagine. It is wisdom you lack. Bonk. They're a new dominant deck in Wild with a new expansion coming out like Demon Seed was slash is. Demon Seed is one of the worst decks that people are actually playing in the Wild format right now. So is does not apply there. Um... I don't know. Things haven't really settled in Wild because it's been three days. I imagine Mech Paladin is pretty far up uh, up there, but maybe not at the same to the same degree as uh, on release Demon Seed. Let your penance begin. Turned our curse into our strength. Ah, ah, I see you brought guests. Whoa, how groovy. All right. Things are getting pretty groovy here. Uh, I'm going to have a bit of a difficult time dealing with, like, a uh, drum circle turn is uh, my concern here. Uh, that actually is a solution to that. Because we can just shove this, get the double shield shatter, and then also draw our Odin for an on-curve play. We get an on curve Jessica Trueheart. Power is what you seek. Knowledge is what I provide. Welcome, Lau. The sea floor be its own treasure. No, not taunts. Six health will be a bit annoying. Yeah, that's why I need both shield shatters. And I just like can't play them until I'm ready to lethal. Which I realize now after the uh, um, Polkelt play is going to be a little bit late. You think with the new nature cards questline, Shaman might be viable. Uh, some sort of Frog Shaman almost certainly is. Don't know if it will be questline or not. Or even if it matters all that much whether it is. What story will you do? So you're a fan of That's rude. At least we can't burn the Odin. Uh, 
but losing the... Maybe we'll just burn Glenn. That would be a sweet one in three. You don't really need questline when Dane is getting turn three to five lethal with APM Shaman. I mean, yeah, the the question going into the expansion was always going to be whether or not you run the quest line, but like, generally speaking, Frog Shaman is probably pretty good as a result of the new cards. I think everybody kind of anticipated that. These mill decks are getting silly. Uh, opponent's not playing a mill deck, though. Lamau, they are definitely deleting Twist. You, because they took their planned break this month, you assume that? That was planned and announced with the announcement of the game mode? You see him smart. So many taunts, but at least we got our boom scheme. Way too dank. Oh, maybe I should have actually just played this. I forgot I had it, to be honest with you. 22 damage now. Scream for me! I built Eden Warrior Day 1 and it took me to gold with no win bonus. I love this deck. Have fun. Hey, I am so far. Thank you, Blaine. No drum circle, no drum circle, no drum circle, no drum circle, please. Please. Oh, that's almost certainly going to get hit a drum circle, isn't it? Not a drum circle, at least. It's still quite bad for me. Did 
and they play both drum circles. One of them was uh, from the Moonlit. You're being a bit of a downer. I bestow these gifts upon the world. That's really too bad. The magic of My hand is too full. I do not have a way to win. I get a free mana refresh now. I'm I'm aware, but what? That's the least of my concerns. I just, the concern is that I have no way to win the game because they get taunts. The 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 mana refresh was completely irrelevant to the outcome of that game. Scheme would have carried. Scheme did exactly nothing. Let your penance begin. Starfish worth trying, Raffle. Nope. Just because a card would have been good in the most recent game doesn't mean it's we good in the deck. There are almost no decks in the wild format that run taunt minions. Druids are the fun place? Yeah, we really need to do something about Saviors of Oldham quest druid. The choose one quest is just way too strong. Everyone knows that. Love the feel of wind in me sails. Love the feel of wind in me sails. Just get a big um, rank or turn next turn. I don't want to confuse it for Dr. Boom's scheme again, though. That would be embarrassing. Wait, is this your deck? Uh, I mean, a lot of people are playing this deck. I don't think I can't claim ownership of a deck. That would be a silly thing to do. So to me, that indicates that they have a prep in hand, right? Which means I am just completely and utterly boned here. I am very much going to lose this game. I had a chance if they didn't make, like, exactly this play. Yeah. I 
That's a really fortunate draw, but probably not enough because they just refill again next turn. So I think I have to hold it for a turn. But then I don't have any way to gain armor, which is a problem. Well, what if we do this? What? <laughs> Love the feel of wind in me sails. Wait for me! What story will you give my work? It's just not good enough to clear three minions right now so with a. Uh, when they have four more in hand. Like, I need to get better value off of these. And pray that I don't just die to a. Like, we know what most of their hand is because of the bouncing. Just need to pray that I don't die to a bunch of uh, chargers. Still need a little bit more for that to be useful.
going even with not having the board clears, you would have had with odd cards. I'm playing an even deck because I wanted to, not because I think it's better. You've been here for a long time. You should know what this channel is about by now. Magnetic basically means charge now. Uh, what do you mean? By now. <laughs> Denathrias versus Jaina. You asked for it. Let your penance begin. Turned our curse into our strength. Uh, not a great hand for a secret mage matchup. First expansion where mechs are good. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You're right. Yeah. Not rigged fair game. Could be an objection though, which would be a bit of a bummer with our Minotauran. Your signature is required. Hmm. That's a bummer. Could have taken the shield chatter here, but it does not feel good. And so I'm not going to. I just need to find one more turn of value, I think. Ideally hitting a frozen buckler, bring it on. Excuse me, you are on fire. I'm late. This is why. Scream for me. Our gift of the arcane enlightens us. Yeah. I just had no way out this game. It's possible I didn't need to take the shield shatter risk, but I mean the second wave was just going to kill me anyway. Uh, I saw. Uh, oh no, that's just chat being slow. Never mind. Denathrias versus Medib. Your time grows short. Let your penance begin. I don't even know what would be worth keeping into Secret Mage. It just feels like 
definitely the Dr. Boom scheme, is it? Um, it just doesn't feel like a very comfortable matchup. Well, at least this one's Renathal, right? I guess we don't know for sure that it's Secret Mage, but it's Secret Mage, of course. Why don't you add Armor Vendor for objection testing? Um, Wicked, there are, there are better ways that you can get attention than just saying dumb stuff in chat. Play the two mana goblin thingy. An incredible discovery. Might be thinking of the kobold. But that's also just not a very good card. Look at this. Already up to five armor. Can't wait for it to get counterspelled. Good. Now everybody's piling on and suggesting nonsensical cards. That's everybody's favorite joke. You got us all laughing. Excuse me, you are on fire. Main deck Oasis Alley is this common? Uh, yeah. Especially in a Renathal deck where you kind of have to make compromises because you're having to add uh, 10 additional cards that don't belong in the deck. Mess with me. Get the horns. I was really hoping they didn't have that. Talking about old mage decks, why did Aluna fall out of favor? Uh, Sage does the same thing, but better. Or at least more immediately. It's not the cost of the card, it's the fact that you... It's the cost and that you're taking the turn off in a tempo deck. Whereas Sage is the same cost and develops a 5-5 body. Gotta set this up for next turn.
probably test with the bring it on. Have you thought about Bran or Zola for the double Odin combo due to its effect stacking? Uh, it would not be very good in this deck. Please don't do this to me. Thank you. Unfortunately, that is probably a fair game, but... have a way to kill that because it's almost certainly something that interacts with a minion you are on fire. scream for me I just lose to the uh, Odin or er, the Orion, pretty much 100% of the time here. This is incredibly miserable. Uh, we were perfectly fine until the Orion came down, but just, like, I didn't get to play the big game anymore. I think I have to keep the war path for the frog. At least it's not secret shaman. Yeah, I can die on turn five instead. That'll be fun. Oh, it's Glenn. That's actually into our strength. much as I hate to say it, probably much better for me than frog shaman. Is uh, Frog Shaman just the like burn shaman with the uh, spirit of the frog? That's a good pickup. Especially if they have like the uh, Totemic Might. Or that. This gave them the best odds at uh Gotta use the uh, shield shatter here. At least their hand isn't that large. 
that's just uh, something that I can allow to happen. Yeah, the sound design and like the graphics for a lot of the recent sets have been top notch. Yeah, welcome, Kali. How are you doing today? Uh, that's pretty bad for me. So now I don't have a play here that's meaningful onto this board. So I don't have a want to attack into. Well, I am just very good at this video game. Did I play Polkeld and not realize it? My god. Fortunately, even Shaman doesn't have great uh, card draw often, so... Well, I th they're going to play Ancestral Knowledge right after I say that, aren't they? I need to shut up right now. Okay, that's also kind of card draw. Yeah, thank you, Christopher. He's just a little guy. Look at him. All right. Bonk here. Bonk here. Like, I don't see how we lose from here. Ancient Totem was the best card there, are you sure? Yeah, that seems pretty unlikely, but... Maybe the others were quite expensive? Or they just wanted to make more copies of it. Probably don't need to draw cards here, I can just clear. No reason to swing this turn. I can uh, use the next turn with the Odin to draw a card and then uh, blast off with some damage behind that. times where we actually managed to um, out-resource an even shaman before they just blasted through me with a ridiculous tempo. How dare you? I'm trying to kill you. Don't you dare play a taunt here or roll a taunt here. Thank you. Look at the boom's value. Easiest game of my life. Shield Shatter draw was nuts, yeah. But you just single handedly won the game. Denatrias versus Sylvanas. Victory for the Forsaken. Let your penance begin. I'm not sure what to expect from Hunter exactly, but our curse into our should be reasonably decent into Beast Hunter. Maybe not with this hand necessarily, but we did get the boom scheme again, so. Okay, right. 
exclamation point costume singer. Caught this one eating party snacks. They love a little fiddle. Sparkle. Oh, that's actually a really good draw here. Uh, where do we want it? Here, because I still have the ranker. Job done. Oh, yes. How can we possibly lose now? Doesn't feel like it's that much damage, right? Let's do this to set up for a ranker again next turn. It worked so well for us the first time when we set it up, right? I see. Now we can't play our boom scheme. You better watch your step as as Really don't want to have to do this, but <laughs> monkey. Please don't be ice trap. Freezing trap. Job done. Okay. I don't know how I'm gonna deal with this monkey though. I appreciate that, Robert. Glad you're enjoying the content. Shield slam? Yeah, shield slam would be fantastic in this deck, you're right. Treadmill stream win. I have considered getting a desk treadmill since I'm standing already anyway. Especially since it's you are so, so hot out right now and yes, which makes it difficult to 
go for walks in the afternoon. plays here in any context. I'll have donations to increase the speed of the treadmill? Oh god. That would be pretty funny. Until I, like, fly off. That would finally find lethal, yeah. Monkey! You lost? Yeah. We've known that for a while now. Glad you're finally able to catch up. For Leo, it was winnable. That's simply not true. <laughs> We're in a better game state now than... You'll find me whatever the action is. Your wish is my suggestion. It's a big monkey. Begin. Mm, guess we keep the bash just for sake of even shaman. We need to be able to deal with. Oof, okay. Well, kind of boned if it's not even shaman, but. We okay. have turned our curse into our strength. Simply remove their stuff until they have no more stuff. We found a lot of our removal. What a great follow up. Found more of our removal. Right. 
Uh, Just Guard does remove the one mana hero power. She makes it two. Robert, thank you for the super chat. I don't think it's worth a shield's shatter on a single totem. how quickly that changes. Kargrath hits a random minion. Or Kazgaroth. Fine. You're welcome, Speedy. Imagine how good ETC with Execute would be. Very good hit. Very good hit. And now I don't have to expend the bring it on. I see a 4 4, that seems so bad. Uh.
nothing when you're the boom scheme. So you're a fan. Oh! God gamer. Our gift of frost shields us. Job done. Does anybody feel like changing their mind about uh, Kazgaroth? So far. Uh, maybe the Primus? He's pretty fun. Thank you, uh, Zach. Order Lowell could have had more health on Kaz. How's that? And how does that matter? As good as I imagined. Should go see what my dog is barking about. And we're probably going to swap deck. 